accept heaven's help and set your sights higher. So you've prayed for help. It's time for you to get out of the way and allow heaven to help you. Whatever you've been praying for, um, it's like you're needing to increase your standards or set your standards a little more higher. Expect more from yourself. Push yourself. And don't settle for something. You could feel like you're not being helped, but you're being helped. And this could be self-doubt, insecurities that make you feel like you have to settle for something or you can't do something. This could be people, certain attachments that make you feel dis disencouraged. They're not encouraging you or um, supporting something that you could want to do. So it's like you're keeping your self-help back to satisfy other people. And it's like you've been praying for a sign, but you're not making a move or you're not you're not paying attention to something. Yeah, it's like something is coming toward you or um, something is going to be a surprise once you take the, the um, first step. Something extremely new awaits you or something is waiting for you. But you feel like something is your duty. Something is your responsibility. Yeah. You could be holding yourself back from being yourself because of other people. It's like you have to be brave about something. Something that you prayed for and you could have forgotten that you prayed for or you wished for, you're manifesting. This is the surprise that's coming to you. Yeah, it's like your wishes are coming true, but you have to set your sights higher. You could be caught up in other people's drama. Or you feel responsible for certain people that are caught up in some type of drama. Yeah, you may need to leave your social um, circles behind. Seek out people that are like-minded like you. It's like if you want to see something blossom, you want to see something grow, you have to um, take initiative. You have to take those steps in order to see that change that you want to see. In order to manifest what you've been praying for, wishing for. Yes, yeah, surrender. You have to leave behind some type of confusion and just move forward with roll the dice being here. You have to take a leap of faith because it's like somebody is trying to confuse you and maybe you don't know this with mystery being here. Now, this could be someone that's trying to play some type of illusion over you to keep you stuck, stagnant. Or to weaken you so you would not have hope or believe in something that You've been um, wishing for, praying for, trying to manifest. We have ghosted.
Then you have family and heartbreak. So this could be a family dynamic that you have to release. These are people that you have to reject. Or stop talking to. If these are people that you're telling your next moves to or different things that you want to manifest, unbeknownst to you with mystery being here, they're trying to create some type of confusion without you being able to figure it out. It's like there's some type of boundary that needs to be set. We have legal matters, heartbreak, and then you have healing. Yeah, you could be definitely seeing that these are people that don't support something or um, they just don't have your best interest at heart. You could be going through some type of legal situation or you went through a legal situation and you felt all alone. This could be because of some type of betrayal. This could be a situation you got yourself in because of another person. That person is someone that's trying to create some type of confusion to stop you from being able to see your worth. Being able to take a leap of faith, take a chance on... Um, manifesting whatever it is that you're trying to manifest. It's like something that you went through is definitely going to help you heal. It's going to help you to want better for your life, better for yourself. Yeah, you may not have seen this coming. This could be definitely a lie. Like somebody could have lied to have you in some type of legal situation. This was a hidden motive. It's like somebody intentionally tried to create some type of obstacle or some type of drama. Yeah, it's like somebody wanted you to be depressed, stressed out. And if this wasn't a family member, this could be somebody that you were close to. This could have been a connection, a relationship, or this could have been a close friend. And your family could, um, like, they don't know why you went through this. And they could still be in communication with that person, around that person, attached to that person. If this was another family member, um, or this could have been a close friend, or this could be even an ex. Like they don't want you to manifest something that you're trying to manifest. This is someone who knows that you're a good person. This is why this person hurt you in the past. They got upset because a cycle was over. Yeah, and they lied in a legal situation. This was to keep you down. This was to keep you um, stuck. We have Aries. You could be an Aries. One of these people could be an Aries. Other people were paid to spread lies on you. You could definitely be seeing this, but all of this took place so you could wake up. You could be more focused. And this is definitely being more focused on something that um, you want to manifest. Something that you have been praying for. Yeah, it's like whoever the people are that you're around, none of these people compare to you. You and those people don't share the same view. 
your perspective is different from their perspective. These are people that they, they have bad intentions for people. Their intentions aren't good. These are people that get angry when they feel like um, they're being centered. They're being called out. They're being questioned for something. Especially if they feel like they've gotten away with something. This could be something simple like giving some type of bad advice. And they're expecting for you to go with what they want you to do. But if you're questioning that decision, that advice, they're upset. They get angry. They don't want you to see these bad intentions. They don't want you to see what... It's like... They don't want you to see what's unknown, what's hidden. They don't want you to think that um, they don't have your best interests. They don't want what's best for you. Now we have Capricorn. You could be a Capricorn. We have the authority. Somebody is under investigation. This could be whoever lied in a legal situation. Yeah, somebody wanted to see you suffer. And this is because this person could have been secretly in competition with you. If this was somebody that was close to you and you just did not know. They got upset because you ended something out. Something that they didn't expect for you to get out of. They definitely could have gotten upset because you were aware of something. You found out something. And they were afraid of you releasing them. So they felt like they had to do something deceptive to keep you stuck. Or you felt like you could not release that person. You had to stay attached to that person, even though you were aware of something. And this could be something that they did. Yeah, it's like now they cannot believe that their plans have backfired. These are people that deal with abandonment issues and they didn't expect to get caught up. Now it's like a lot of people are being watched. People that they're attached to, if they were behind the scenes doing something to you, you could be being watched too. People that you're attached to. Now, somebody is secretly in love with you. <clears throat> something took place in the past with right person, wrong time. We have Libra. You could be a Libra. One of these people could be a Libra. A setup got exposed and the truth was never supposed to get out. Whatever this was that was being set up, you were protected from this. So this legal situation, if there was lies told in a legal situation that caused an injustice legal matter, they wanted this to break you. They wanted people to disown you. They definitely wanted your family to disown you because I see ghosted and family. This talks about um, ignored, silence, rejected. Like they wanted people to reject you. They wanted people to feel like whatever these um, accusations, these lies were that they paid people to spread was true. But they didn't think that you would be protected from this. Now, whoever this person is that um, that is in love with you, and if this isn't your family or somebody that was close to you that did this, the person that's in love with you, this person has to release a group of people. It's like those people have been trying to create some type of blockages for them. Um, they've created some type of legal matter could be for that person or they tried to create a legal matter for you. Especially if you're someone that spreads awareness, you could have made that person aware of something that they didn't want that person to know. And they tried to set you up. This caught them by surprise. 
whatever you warned them about, whatever you said, they were shocked. They were surprised. And they thought that they were going to make up some type of false illusion around you to get people to disown you, distance their self from you, think negative about you. But you were protected from this. This card says, get ready to receive something special soon. Someone is wanting to express the way that they feel about you. And this could, this, it's like they're wanting to give you some type of surprise gift. Especially if you've helped that person to, um, go through some type of awakening. Now they're aware. They're wanting to give you some type of gift, but this could come in the form of the physical or the spiritual realm. And it's definitely going to bring you and that person closer. This definitely could be um, a romantic gesture, 3D communication, or this could be telepathic communication. But it's definitely going to surprise you you're not going to expect this this could be someone that you have not heard from but your inspiration to that person yeah this is someone who is definitely starting a new beginning or they're wanting to start a new beginning a new chapter in their life it's like they realize what they were missing in life and they feel like the the thing that is missing is you. This is definitely new love that's coming toward you. And they feel like there's no going back, only forward. They can't unsee what has already been seen. Yeah, they want to have a fresh new start with you. This is someone who wants you to know just how special um, you are to them. Them not being able to express their self, there could be some type of communication issue on that person's end. It's like they were afraid to open up, but now they're wanting to open up. Whatever they were afraid to do, it's been killing that person irritating that person it has them like way down in their emotions this person um they feel like you're someone that is very amazing very compassionate very kind and with promise being here this is someone that is promising that they'll make something right with you Yeah, somebody is definitely realizing that they have to set their standards higher, their sights higher. They have to want what's best for their self. Because whatever they're praying for, they cannot manifest it around a certain group of people. Now, if this person ghosted you after you made them aware of something and these people got behind the scenes and tried to set you up this was to make that person stay away from you this was supposed to make that person reject you they wanted them to believe whatever these false accusations are or whatever they lied about yeah but this is someone that's in love with you it's like they could not change how this person feels about you. Yeah, and they know that you and them have a soul connection. Yeah, they ran because they weren't ready, but now they're wanting to make things right. These are people that are realizing whatever they were trying to do to get this person to stay away from you. Um, it was only 
making this person that you have this soul connection realize they have to release those people. It's helping them to realize things that they need to let go of. This is someone who definitely knew you were the one when they first met you. And they're wanting to apologize for whatever took place between you and them in the past. This is someone who have definitely prayed to be in a connection with you. Or they prayed for something. But when it came, they weren't ready. It's like when the opportunity came, they just were not ready in the past. And this is because this person needed to make a decision to move on from people that are um, not serving their highest good. This card says your time is coming. Everything is coming together for you, but you must meet the universe halfway. Hold only a bright and happy vision of yourself with successful outcomes and don't allow your fears or insecurities to stand in your way. So them holding on to whoever these people are, it was keeping them from being able to manifest what they've been praying for. It's keeping them in the energy of feeling like they don't deserve something. They should fear something. Instead of thinking positive and optimistic, This is someone who simply needed to stand in their power, take action, take control of their life in order to see a positive um, version of their self or be a better version of their self. Yeah, so this is someone who definitely plans on making something right with you. They want to communicate with you. And as I said, this could be telepathic communication because there's a strong psychic connection between you and this person. Or this could be 3D communication, like they're going to reach out to you and this is going to surprise you. But they needed to release whoever these people are. They needed to see the blockages before they were able to move forward. Because it's like if this person would have came towards you at the time that they came towards you in the past and not be aware of what was going on behind the scenes or the blockages or they were avoiding them, this would have messed up something. It would have um, this would have definitely stopped a healing process that needed to take place for this person. So a separation was needed if this is someone that you have a soul connection with. And know that separation is only an illusion. That person is always around you if you have a soul connection with them. They're always telepathically communicating with you, sending you different signs, synchronicities. Yeah, that person higher self is always attached to 